Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Ashley Nicole, and today my hair is feeling a little flat, a little bit boring and short. So if you wanna learn how to go from this to this, then keep on watching. I'm just gonna show you how to add some hair extensions to add length and also to add a little bit of volume to your everyday look. It's super easy, so let's go ahead and get started. First off, you're gonna need a hairbrush. And then you're also going to need one of these little clippies, some dry shampoo, and that's it. So let's go ahead and start splitting our hair. I feel like putting dry shampoo in sections really helps to keep the extensions together. Also, my hair is a bit oily, so this helps for me to have the look last a little bit longer throughout the day. And I really just like to put it all over my crown, on the tops of my head, on the back, and on the under part around my neck. So these are all the areas where I'm going to be putting the extensions on. Once I'm done applying the dry shampoo, I like to start massaging and then also brushing out all of the dry shampoo throughout my hair so it takes away all the rest of the oils that have collected all throughout the day and then I go ahead and I start off with three clipped weft and I'm going to put this right at the bottom of my neck so it's going to be covering pretty much the bottom portion. I do have darker hair at the bottom but I find it does blend quite well after I style it. So I'm basically just going to be doing this section by section. I do like to put it in certain sections because that's what I'm used to. I feel like it gives me the most volume, the most coverage, and the most blendability throughout my whole hairstyle look. This section right here that I'm putting right behind my ears is really the biggest section or the thickest section I should say that also has the longest weft. I do have different layers and I did get them cut by my stylist so they do blend even better with my hair. Once you cut them to the length of your hair, it just helps to make the whole look look a lot more natural. Next section I'm going to be applying is going to be right at my temples. This is basically right above the previous weft that I just put in. And the reason why I put it here is because I do like the center of my scalp to be the pretty much thickest area because I do have a little bit of thin hair. So I just put another fork clip weft and that way it makes it look really thick in that area. Now just moving on to the next section this is going to be a little bit more above my temples I'm just going to be putting in a three clip weft because four clips I always find they show a little bit more on the side now the reason why I put another one on is because it gives it a little bit more dimension different layers in the back and once again it's just going to be adding to the thickness it helps everything blend a lot more Now that I have most of my wefts in, I do like to brush my hair out because I'm going to start putting the top layers in and it makes it a lot more manageable if you just kind of brush it out any tangles that you've had along the way. For my top section, I like to put two clip wefts and I like to put them at a little bit of an angle. This way they kind of start to the top and then move down towards the back so that you can't really see them on the back side of my head. And this makes it a lot more seamless if you want to part your hair in different ways. I only put two clips and this is just to blend my front layer because my front layer naturally is a lot shorter than the rest of my hair.
that we're all done, I'm just gonna give it my final brush through so I can start blending all the layers together and just make sure that I don't have any of the clips sticking out on the sides or in the back and I kind of just fill it out and look at them in the mirror. All right, this is the final look. That's it guys. If you like this, give it a thumbs up and please subscribe down below. Maybe next time I can show you guys how to curl extensions and style. Thanks again for watching. Bye.